guys, what's up? It's Andrew from the Checkered Flag Crew. We're here with Trevor Bain. What have you learned from your first full-time season at Roush Family Racing? Well, it's been a tough season for us, and we've learned a lot. I've learned how to deal with uh, adversity a little bit, but uh, really we're just, um, it's a grind, you know, when you're here every weekend racing every weekend for four days, you're gone, and uh, you just gotta really learn how to communicate well with your group of guys, and I think my crew chief and I have really communicated better. Our results haven't shown that, but I think we're getting better and better at it, so that's probably the biggest thing I've learned. How has it been working with Jack Roush and everyone at Roush Fenway? Uh, Jack's been great for me in my career. You know, he's been behind me for the last seven or eight years, so it's been uh, good to work with him, and uh, he's a great guy and good to drive for. Have you and your team started preparation for next year? Uh, yeah, we have. We've uh, been working pretty hard here to get everything together for next year. Um, obviously, like I said before, we don't like our results from this year, so we're always fighting for more, and uh, I think next year is going to be better for us. Do you have any plans for the off season? Uh, for the off season, we're having a baby in a couple weeks, so that's going to take up a lot of our time. So that's basically what we'll be doing all the time. How is that going to change your approach for next year, having her at the racetrack? Uh, having a little baby girl at the track is going to be weird for me, but uh, I've got a great wife, and she'll take good care of her when I'm out here on the racetrack. And outside the racetrack, I hear you like to do some snowboarding. How did you get interested in that? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm an action sports guy, so snowboarding, wakeboarding, uh, anything that you can do that gets your adrenaline going. You know, race car drivers kind of like that kind of stuff. So I uh, started doing it when I was about 10 or 11 and just really liked it, so I keep doing it. Where's been the cool? coolest place you've gone snowboarding? Uh, the coolest place probably Jackson Hole, Wyoming. Uh, there's a lot to do there other than just snowboarding. It's a beautiful place, so I enjoyed that one a lot. Which would you say you like more then, snowboarding or wakeboarding? Uh, I, I wakeboard more frequently just because we live on the lake and get to do that more. So uh, the snowboarding is more of like a vacation thing, which is really fun. So I probably enjoy that one more. When was the last time you went snowboarding? Uh, last, last winter. Okay. Yep. And we're going to do a segment we like to call Would You Rather. As part of the segment, we'll give oh, you two boy. options. I'm pretty indecisive. This could be tough here. Oh, no. It, you'll be fine. And you have to choose which you would rather do. All right. Okay. Would you rather drive with the giant Fig Newton sticker on your windshield or with your hood up the whole time? Uh, we'll go with the hood up. I can see under it a little bit, so it'll be all right. Have you seen the movie Talladega uh, Nights? I've seen it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Live in a world where everyone looks like Donald Trump or everyone looks like you? Ooh, that'd be, that's a tough one there. I don't think everybody wants to look at a lot of me, so uh, <laughs> I'll go with Donald Trump on that one. Well, one of the benefits with you is like you can just like sort of look in the mirror and look at yourself. Yeah, you know? I, I guess. There you go. <laughs> All right. Um, grow a mustache every time you can't answer a question or grow a nose every time, you, like Pinocchio, every time you lie? Well, I'll go with a mustache because I can't really grow a good one, so we're kind of the same on that, so that'd be nice to be able to grow one for once. Alright. Wear a full suit of armor four months straight or scuba gear? Uh, I'll go with uh, scuba gear. I'll just stay in the water and stay cool. Yeah. Go wakeboarding? you can move then, you know. Yeah. And finally, since the new Star Wars movie is coming out, have lightsaber fingernails or have the ability to have Jedi mind tricks? Oh, we'll play some mind tricks on people. Mind we can mess with some people. Everybody. Yeah, we'll be good then. All right. Thank you, Trevor, Thanks. for taking the time. For more videos from the Checkered Flag Crew, make sure to visit CheckeredFlagCrew.com.